Hello, hello everyone, how are you doing today? So, it's me, Jean Paulson again, with the second part of my NES reviews. This time, it's Balloon Fight, one of the new NES games which I played. Alright, so, let's get this game started. Whoa, that was basically quick. So the controls for this game are left and right move the character B and A to fly. Uh, ouch! I'm dead. I like the music when I get a new life because I do 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 do. Okay. Sorry, but I'm a bit rusty at the game. Ah, oh, come on! I wonder why I got two balloons instead of one at the start, but oh well, it's no problem. It's no big deal. I recommend being super accurate. This game is based on being accurate and fast. Just like the previous game on the review list. Uh oh. There's a thunder coming up. Oh, I think it's done now. Ah, come on! I'm dead. Alright, let's, let's play the game again. Yeah, you can push them in the water, and they'll get eaten. Yeah, good idea. Very good idea. No, no, ah! Ah, come on. Ow. Ouch. All right, done. All right, that's one. I don't really know much about the game, but all you need to do is just knock out everyone. And the way to do it is just to fly on top of the balloon and hit the parachute. Or just drag them into the water. But no, then let them hit yours, or else you're dead. Yeah, like what happened to me just now. It's not of the game with actually two lives, so it's not really a big deal. There we go. When they're on the floor, they're gonna pump up their balloon, so be really quick to hit them. There's something in this game which I wanna show you. And that's a bonus round. I've reached it just before I started filming. Ah! Ah. Ah, I at least want to show the. I want to at least show the bonus round. Oh yeah, and this game it was re-released on the Nintendo e-reader. Just thought I'd let you know that. If you have a Nintendo e-reader or if you're planning to get one, and if you like balloon fights, you can get the game. At the start, all the enemies always start pumping up their balloons. So I recommend just simply running into them. Whoops, I hit the pause. I hit the pause button. No, no. Okay, good. 
Wow, good thing I was safe. What the? Just tell me what happened there. Um. Oh well. So, let's just get the game done with. Because I just feel like showing you the bonus round. I'm just gonna let it go and get him go into water. And we're done. The bonus round. This is exactly what I've been wanting to show you. So the bonus round, you gotta hit all the balloons. The more you hit, the more points you get. Whoops, I missed one. Not a big deal. Yeah, I may have a lucky chance of getting extra lives. And you can hop from one screen to the other, so it's a really bit might need to deal. But Nintendo had done with the game with the game making. Ah! <sighs> okay. I'm guessing if you pass the high score you'll get more points. This is like Mario Brothers. Where they have a a sort of bonus round. Bonus rounds are cool, aren't they? Well, not in way that well, as as long as you're done with the level, it could have a bonus round. You can have the chance of getting extra points, and maybe the chance of getting an extra life. Yeah, that's went into it. Okay. Ah, right, I hit the pause button again. What's that all about? Ow. These bubbles, they will give you points if you ram into the bubbles. I don't know if they can inflate your balloon, I don't think they will. If they do, just tell me. If you are an expert at the game. I need an expert at the game so I can remake the review. With more information. But there's very little as far as I know. Letting enemies go down in the water is a good thing. I just gotta let him go down. Alright, good. Well, I'm doing pretty good. Um, yeah. Good. Alright, bonus round number two. And this is the first time I experienced this one, so I have no idea about this. Um, I think it's pretty much the same thing. Except it's for color balloons. They may give more points, I don't know. I think they give more points, we'll find out. Just try hit all the balloons. I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. Extra points for me! Whoa, this game's getting harder. So I wonder what I think the build does. It probably just rotates me. Ow, I'm dead. I actually did pretty good. And there's one last thing I want to show you. And that's the... The balloon trip. It's some kind of, like, other game is feature number two of the game. So basically, you need to hit the balloons and avoid the, the flashy stuff. If you hit the flashy stuff, you are dead. 
and you get only one try, so that's pretty bad. Actually, let me just show you this a bit. This is entirely based on accuracy and... Yeah. Be careful, you can get eaten as well, like in the original game. Moving sparks? Why would the sparks want to move? Am I done? Oh, I thought I was done. I am dead. Well, I did a bit better. So. So, that's Balloon Fight. You can also play to player game, but I cannot do that. Because I don't have anyone with me, and my emulator just has only one player hooked up. So, that's basically it. That's Balloon Fight. A really great NES game. You can play it if you, if you want. So. There are these here's how you can play it. Emulation. Buy it on the NES. E reader card. And yeah, that's what. So that's Balloon Fight. Stay tuned for more videos and thank you for watching.